So my name's Tyler and I'm the coordinator of the EPQ. Uh, the EPQ is worth half an A-level and it's a really exciting course that you can engage with in your time with us at Derby College. The EPQ will teach you things like how to reference, how to research, and in the end you come out with either a 5,000 word report or an artifact of some sort. And that artifact can be really exciting, so that could be anything from a sculpture to we've had a pizza this year, we've had different bits of bacon. Um, so it's really up to you. The EPQ is really beneficial for when you go to uni because not only do universities really like the EPQ and often they'll offer you a lower entry offer because of EPQ, it also teaches you them really valuable skills. So when I went to uni I had no idea how to reference but the EPQ students will all go to university knowing exactly what they're doing when it comes to referencing. Um, you will meet once a week with me when you do your EPQ and you'll have a supervisor assigned to you and your supervisor will have one-to-ones with you and they'll guide you through the process. So whilst this is an independent qualification, you absolutely at no point feel on your own. We're here to help you every step of the way. Uh, my name is Sammy Lieberter. I am doing film, business and computer science in A-level. Um, I decided to write the start of a book for my EPQ. I thought it would be a good idea to, you know, get kind of start writing a book. I think that'd be really interesting. Um, and for somebody trying to start doing EP or wanting to do EPQ, um, I, I think it's a great idea because I think it gives you time. It gives you like the motivation to start a project of your own, and you get great qualifications for it. It really brings down your uh, your predicted grades, and it's it's a great it's a great way of doing it. Hi, my name is Carolina Kiss. I do business criminology and applied psychology here at Derby College, and I have chosen to do EPQ because I believe that this will benefit me for the future and my future plans. I have chosen to do an artifact, which I have done about Teslas, and I have talked about how Teslas are environmentally friendly, and I also did a little car model, which I took Tesla's concept from, but on a smaller scale, which meant that I took a remote control car, made it environmentally friendly by putting solar panels on it, so that it's all run by solar energy. And I also changed out the batteries in them, which means that they are reusable, so less waste for the environment. And I just did a uh, 1,500 word essay about Tesla and everything. And I believe that you should also do EPQ because it is a really good opportunity to talk about what you love and all the topics and you can just talk about anything you want and I think it's brilliant to do on the side of all your other courses. Hi, my name is Liana Clark. I take mathematics and fine art at Derby College and my EPQ is about how beauty standards have affected society over time. One thing I'd say to someone taking EPQ is that it's really helpful for your UCAS points and it's actually really enjoyable and if you pick a subject that you really enjoy talking about, it's a lot of fun and definitely worth it. My name is Andrew Vintaleski and I'm currently studying English Language, English Literature and Sociology and uh, I'm doing an extended project based around family law which is titled Should Children's Opinions Be Considered in Custody Cases? Um, I would definitely recommend doing EPQ in the future because it really does provide you with um, a key set of skills that will help you at university if you're considering that. Um, I'm Fabton and I do A-level art and BTEC law and this is my EPQ, it's about architecture where I talk about um, how I constructed a 3D model of the dome and why it was such an important piece for the Renaissance period. And I love Derby College because it gave me the opportunity to really express my love for art. And uh, We are both in art A-level together and we spend a lot of our time in the art classrooms trying to explore new ways that we can create art and I feel like this EPQ has been a great way to explore that even further with different materials like you've never used yeah. cardboard before to create yeah, yeah, yeah. a structure like this so it's given us a great chance to explore further of what we love. Yeah. My name is Jack Stephen, I'm a second year A-level student here at Joseph White and um, I do currently for my A-levels I do business, English literature and law for the moment. Uh, my EPQ was on uh, medical assistance in dying over in North America. So I did about Canada and America and the uh, law surrounding such a topic that interferes with a lot of morals and a lot of religious teachings. So I decided to explore both the law and the moral argument against why it should be legalised or not. 
And I think if you're going to picky pick you in the future, I'd one have an end goal in mind. So perhaps if you want to go to university or an apprenticeship, make sure your topic is relevant to your further area of study, and just keep consistent. I mean, it's a it's quite a long project, but if you've got got a bit of grit, then you'll be absolutely fine.